This has sort of been the heart and soul of CDOC is this opener. We, we kind of designed, we started this design in 1992 and it's not much different really than that first machine in 92. We, you know, it pivots at the frame here and the packer wheel follows the ground and it's forced to follow the ground by the hydraulic cylinder pulling it all the time. So, so these knives then are always at the same depth because the, the cylinder's pulling that packer wheel against the ground and forcing the, the openers to follow. So that gave us such good depth control. And I know in your country, you know, you, if you're, it's cold and wet in the spring and you don't want to seed too deep. And with the old drills back in the air seeder days, you were seeding all kinds of different depths. But when we come up with this, we were able to, you know, set canola at half or three quarters of an inch and it would seed it all at the same depth. So that's sort of what really uh, got us started in the business, this opener. And then we've made some nice improvements to it. We, we put some great bushings in all, to all the pivot points, whether they're cylinders or or wherever, but uh, one of the nice advancements we made, uh, uh, I think it was about in 2005 or something, we, we put this quick pin depth setting in because you do have to set every opener, which is the disadvantage of a big air seeder where you just change the whole frame. But So you pull this pin out and you, you put a three quarter inch wrench on here and you adjust it and put the pin, pin back into whatever setting you want. But what that does is it actually, because that that actually depth adjustment pivots around this bolt. It actually moves both the seed and the fertilizer the same amount. Because we used to move the packer wheel up and down and that, that affects the seed more than the fertilizer. So I always like to see the fertilizer about three quarters of an inch deeper than the seed.